Good day, my name is Wando Mchekula. I am a financial planner and this is my new YouTube channel where we're going to be discussing many, many things, a variety of things. Uh, we're going to be discussing all things finance. Uh, we're going to be discussing holistic uh, financial planning. We're going to be discussing risk planning, investment and savings planning, wills and estate planning, uh, education planning, retirement planning. Uh, we're going to be discussing GEPF, Government Employee Pension Fund. We're going to be discussing a variety of things. But mostly, I specialize with investments and savings. I specialize with wealth creation. I specialize with wealth, uh, wealth uh, preservation and wealth distribution. This channel is all going to be about that. Welcome to my channel and thank you for subscribing. Uh, we're going to be discussing uh, on a weekly basis the, the, the state of the economy of the country and the Southern Africa. We're going to be discussing a variety of things. Uh, for instance, this week we're supposed to be discussing the budget speech by the Minister of Finance of South Africa, um, where we were going to be knowing what has increased and what has decreased, how much did he allocate for which department and things like that. We're supposed to be discussing uh, the impact of what uh, the minister announced about the 45% uh, pension fund that is now allowed to be invested on offshore markets. We were supposed to be discussing those. We're supposed to be going into detail uh, about the budget speech of this week. However, now there is a pressing issue now, the issue of the Russia and Ukraine. Everyone is wondering how is it going to affect us. Everyone is wondering how is it going to affect Southern Africa, and uh, how is it going to how is it going to affect everyone in Africa in terms of uh, in terms of uh, economy, the economics of what is happening in uh, Russia and Ukraine, and uh, South Africa. Let's speak about South Africa. In South Africa, uh, we, we we get some of our low oil from uh, Euro. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Russia is part of Europe. We've been getting some, even though it's not more than 5% that what we have been getting. Uh, so that is going to be affecting us. Uh, the, the economy, the, we saw yesterday and the day before, the economy of Russia going down. We saw yesterday oil, oil, 105 uh, 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 USD, that is dollars, US dollars, that was the price of oil yesterday. Uh, uh, per barrel that is in South African rent is 1,600 rent uh, uh, per barrel that was the price of oil yesterday that was a huge huge it skyrocketed the price of oil the price of oil skyrocketed um, South African companies invest in uh, like uh, companies such as Anglo Platinum and, uh, and, and, uh, and the mining companies they invest in Russia uh, they have investment and they have assets in Russia. So that is going to be affecting them big time. That is going to be affecting them uh, big time in a big way. So those are the things that we support. People are, are concerned about. Is my investment safe? Is my everything safe? Am I offshore safe? The good news is only 6% of offshore investment that a JSC company are investing in places like Russia. So it's not going to be affected that much in terms of your investment that you have invested. But the general economy around uh, South Africans is going to be hit hard. It's going to be hit hard. It's going to be a problem for everyone. Uh, it's going to be difficult to get petrol. Petrol price, we know already it was almost 20 rand the, uh, this week or before, the, before this Russia thing. Next week is due to go high. Uh, again, uh, the first of March, the first week of March, uh, it's gonna be also be skyrocketing. Those are the things that uh, are affecting us. Those are the, uh, some of the casualties that we have to take care of in terms of the economy and the and the Russia uh, and, and the politics and the war in Russia. Those are the things that is affecting us big time. The instability is a big factor, contributing factor to any decline of the economy. And we know South African economy has already had its own problems, such as the COVID. Uh, it affected us big times in terms of production, in terms of the GDP. High employment rate, one of the highest employment rates in the world. It has been a problem to us way before the COVID-19. And it has been a problem way before uh, 
uh, the Russia and the, and the Ukraine. So uh, basically, if you are an investor, for now, the government has done a lot of things. Government has a lot of good uh, safeguards in, in place to help us with this, with this kind of things. Uh, to safeguard us. So if you have been investing, most of our investment in South Africa are guided by the Regulation 28, which protects us, uh, which protects the investors, South African investors. And uh, we have been investing only a mere 6% outside of South Africa, uh, especially the Russian side, the Eastern Europe, I think, and things like that. So that is where we are standing. Now, we don't know how long is this going to take, the, the war, and we don't know uh, how much more side effect is this going to cause uh, in terms of the economy. So it is important, uh, this is the opportunity where I remind everyone that it is very much important to consider taking things like retirement annuity, where your investments are guaranteed until the age of 55. It is important to take investments such as tax-free savings. Uh, those are good invest, uh, uh, investment that you should be considering. Unit trust, which invest uh, not that much uh, in, uh, in, in, in Russia or the Eastern Europe side, uh, which is also a, a better investment. Offshore are affected because this is happening in Europe, uh, of course, but it's not going to hit South Africans that much in terms of investment. So in terms of investment, I would say keep calm for now, relax. Uh, South African government have everything in place. South African uh, companies, uh, investment companies, they have everything uh, to protect the investment of their clients. So for now, I'll suggest that you, you, you relax. Um, that is all for now. And this was just a brief, this was just an introduction to my YouTube channel. I'm happy that you have uh, all watched the channel and subscribed. Thank you very much. Uh, the, also, the other thing that I wanted to remind you, in terms of retirement investment, always contact me. My number is 066-494-9204. Give me a call and contact me. Follow me on uh, on Twitter. Follow me on, a, on, a, on, a, on, a, on, a, on Facebook. The Facebook page is All Things Finance. That is where you're going to be getting in-depth analysis of what is happening in terms of investment and things and so on. Thank you very much for subscribing. This was Luandom Chepula uh, of All Things Finance. We're discussing wealth creation, wealth preservation, and wealth distribution. Thank you very much.